Hey guys, Taylor here in Guangzhou again, back with another video. And uh, today it's a Thursday afternoon and uh, I haven't eaten anything yet today. I'm very starving. So I'm about to head out with my wife and my daughter to go get some Chinese food in our area. And uh, you know, if you've seen any of my other videos, you'll know that uh, Guangzhou has some pretty awesome food. Uh, Chinese food, Western food, food from all over the world. Uh, but today, it's all about Chinese food, and we're actually going to head to one of my wife's favorite restaurants, actually, uh, very close to where we live, and they do some really good spicy fish. Uh, I can't remember what province uh, this food is from. We're going to find out again when we get there, because my wife can't remember either. So we're going to check it out when we get there, and I'll let you know what province in China this particular restaurant uh, is from. But uh, it's supposed to be a very good uh, relatively healthy as well. You know, I've had a couple cheat days recently. <laughs> been drinking a few more beers than I should have been and eating some uh, pretty bad food that I shouldn't have been. Uh, so I need to get back on the back on track here and have a nice healthy lunch. So we're going to head over there uh, to this restaurant and uh, we'll see you when we get there. restaurant now uh, they're just about to open so we should be able to get in there and it shouldn't be too busy but if you go around dinner time or in the night time it's really really busy and they usually have a long lineup to get in and you have to wait half an hour uh, that's how popular it is here so I'm really looking forward to this because I am so starving right now and I'm glad that we're not gonna have to wait for this right now because uh, I don't think I'm gonna make it It turns out I was wrong. According to my wife, uh, it's not necessarily the restaurant that is so popular. It's the actual dish itself. And uh, Kasa, how do you say the name of it in Chinese? Shuan Cai Yu. Ah, okay. And it's it's a spicy fish dish, but it's also very sour. It's like a, a sour, spicy, sour and spicy fish dish. And uh, it's very popular here. And we still can't remember what province it's from. It's either Hunan or Sichuan. We're gonna check as soon as we get to the restaurant and uh, we'll let you know. We're almost there. We are a couple minutes away. So we just got to the restaurant and yeah, yeah, we were right. The food is actually from Hunan province and that's a province that's north of Guangdong, which is where we are right now. And uh, they're really famous for their spicy food. And the restaurant itself is actually called Hunan Home. Uh, at least that's what it says on the little packet of tissues that they gave us. Uh, so yeah, it's gonna be absolutely delicious. A little bit spicy, a little bit sour. And uh, I just can't wait to dig into it because my stomach is killing me. I'm so hungry. All right, to start off, we got some flower tea here. And this stuff is actually very good. A little bit of a sweet taste to it. You can see they put the flower inside, inside the hot water. And after a few minutes, it starts to open up. 
into uh, into a nice flour actually, and uh, the taste comes from the flour itself, and it actually goes really well with spicy food. I really enjoy this. Well, we just ordered our food. We ordered the signature fish dish that this restaurant is famous for, and we ordered some duck blood and a vegetable dish as well. And it's all going to be spicy, I believe, except for the duck blood, but uh, it's going to be amazing. All right, so our sour and spicy fish is here, and it smells absolutely amazing. Uh, I cannot wait to dig into this. Here we go. And, oh, our vegetable dish has just arrived as well. This is a uh, Hudan style vegetable dish, and it's going to be very good. All right, so let's try the fish. Nice big piece here. Oh, it smells very good, very good. Mm. Oh yeah, definitely a really a sour taste to it. <clears throat> but you really get hit with that spice. <clears throat> wow. Really get hit with that spice as soon as you try it. The good thing about it is, is it's not an overwhelming spicy, so it's not going to uh, make you not want to eat it. It's very enjoyable, uh, not too spicy. For someone like me, I enjoy spicy food, but to a certain extent. If something is so overwhelmingly spicy, I just don't enjoy it. But this is very enjoyable. Here we got the duck blood. This is duck blood. It's in the soup as well. So I'm going to try this one right now. Mm. Very good. The texture is kind of like a tofu. Um, it doesn't really have a, the, the duck blood doesn't really have a taste itself, but you get that taste of the, the soup broth. That's sour and spicy taste. It's very nice. All right, so our second vegetable dish has arrived. This is the non-spicy one. This is the one Buffy's gonna be eating. And our other one here on the far side is the spicy one. My wife says it's very spicy. I'm gonna give it a try right now. <clears throat> All right, so here we go with the spicy vegetable dish. Here we are. Mm. Very, very tasty. Very, very tasty. This, oh. Yeah, definitely taste the spice. It hits you a little bit, uh, a little bit later. And, uh, but also, this one not too bad either. Uh, it's a good level of spice. Very enjoyable. Uh, it's definitely not going to uh, send you running for the pitcher of water. That's for sure. It's it's very enjoyable. Uh, if you like spicy food, you'll definitely enjoy this dish. Hmm. Very very tasty. Let's go for some more fish. And the fish is just, you can tell it's very, very fresh and it just melts in your mouth as well and it's bursting with that sour and spicy flavor and it's just, uh, it's fantastic. I highly recommend if, you, if you've never tried uh, food from Hunan province and if you do like seafood or fish, uh, you should definitely try this dish. One more time, how do you say the name of it? Okay, so I'll, I'll leave it uh, a description in the comment section below so you can see uh, how to say the name. Mm. Very, very good.
finished our lunch, our uh, Swan Tai Yu, our spicy, sour and spicy Hunan fish. It was absolutely delicious. I highly recommend it if you're a fan of spicy food. And you can see in China, there's so much food to choose from. It's, it's a foodie's paradise. Uh, at least here in Guangzhou it is, that's for sure. I, you know, every region in China or every province has their own uh, style of food, has their own version of Chinese food. So when you, when you talk about Chinese food, uh, it's very hard to, to just think of it as one, one thing because there's so many different variations of Chinese food that come from the different regions here in China. And uh, this lunch that we had, like I said before, is from the Hunan province. That's uh, a province that's north of where I am now. And they do some really good spicy food. So definitely have to check it out. Uh, check out the description below for, uh, for uh, the location of this restaurant that we just went to and uh, the name of the dish that we just had. All right, guys. So don't forget to just subscribe to my channel for more videos on life in China, as well as some of the best places in Guangzhou. All right, so until next time, this is Taylor in Guangzhou. Have a great day.